In this video, I'm going to show you a mental addition technique called compensating, or as I like to think of it, only kidding. The reason why I call it only kidding is because it looks like I'm going to add one number. Let's say I'm going to add 50 onto a number, but I'm only kidding. I'm actually then going to take one away so that I've only added 49. This works particularly well when you're adding numbers that are close to a multiple of 10. So, for example, 29 or 39 or 59 or even uh, numbers ending in 1 because they're still close to multiples of 10. So numbers like 41 or 11 or 21 or 31, etc. This is a useful technique. The only kidding technique is useful for adding numbers such as those. Right, the one I am going to do though is 35 plus 29. So using a horizontal number line, I'll mark 35 first of all on the number line and then add not 29 but 30. Of course, I'm only kidding. I'm not really intending to add 30. I'm only meant to be adding 29. So I'm going to have to take one away. Right, well, let's find out what my answer would be. 35, add 30, 65, take away 1, 64. There we go, answer 64. On a vertical number line, if that's easier for you to imagine, then it would look like this. 35, add 30. Only kidding, I'm only meant to be adding 29, so I'll take one away. 35 add 30 is 65, take away 1, 64. Our answer is 64 again, no surprise there. And on a 100 grid, this is what it would look like. 35 to start with, add 30, 10, 20, 30, Ooh, only kidding, meant to take one away. That leaves us on 64. Okay, let's see another version of that. 52 add 41 on a horizontal number line. Here's 52 add 40. Oh, only kidding, that's not enough. I need to add another one so that I've added 41 altogether. 52 add 40 gives us 92. Add 1 gives us 93. So our answer is 93. On a vertical number line, if I put 52 down here, add 40, of course, you know what I'm going to say, I'm only kidding, because I need to add another one, so that I've added 41. 52 add 40 is 92, 92 add 1, 93. And on a 100 square, it looks like this, 52 is here, add 40, 10, 20, 30, 40, only kidding, I need to add another one so that I get to 93. Okay, that's how to use compensating or the only kidding approach with two examples. I'm going to put these problems up on the board and let you think about them for a while. If you pause the video, I'll come on to my way of using compensating on these six, seven problems in just a moment. Okay, hopefully you've had the chance to have a think about how you'd use compensating with these. Right, starting with 34 plus 49, what I would do is I'd add 50 and then take away 1. Here in this example, I would probably add 30 instead of 29 and then take away 1. Down here, instead of adding 28, I would add 30, but then take away 2. Well, we've seen this kind before. We'd add 40 and then add 1. Over here, we'd probably add 20 and then add 1. Now, these last two, I deliberately put up to throw us. I'm not sure that I'd use compensating there because they're not, neither of these numbers are particularly close to multiples of 10, and neither are these two. 
So in which case, I'd probably use a different mental addition technique, which you can see in some of the other videos, such as partitioning or counting on. Okay, that's the end of this video. Hope it's been useful. Try some of the others for some more mental addition techniques.